Hazel, I'll let you out here. Oh, ain't you coming in with me? No, I'll wait right here in the car. I have a few legal problems to think out, and this is as good a place to do them as any. All right, you just sit there and mull them over. The door, Hazel. Yeah? Uh, how can you get the things at the store for Dorothy if I haven't given you the slips? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Here's what she wants at the market. Yeah. The things from the drugstore huh? and the dime store. Oh, look who's going down the street. Who? Mr. Merrick, the scoutmaster. If you run fast enough, you can catch him. Why should I? Well, well we got to find out about tomorrow night. You know, Harold taking the tenderfoot oath. We got to find out if we all got to be there and what time it is, you know, and what we got to wear. Hazel, I hardly think it's going to be a white tie and tails affair. Yeah, well, we got to find out, what, you know, whether the ceremony is going to be at the meeting house or around the campfire. And we got to know. All right, Hazel, I'll give him a ring. You want me to handle it for you? Yes, Hazel, thanks. I'll appreciate that. Well, and don't you worry, I'll get all the dope. Oh, he, he, you better take this list of the stuff Missy wants. Hazel! He hasn't even attempted to take them. What? As a matter of fact, I've, I've been expecting a call from his father. Oh, but his dad and me thought he'd passed all his tests. Well, he seemed to feel he wasn't ready. Well, that don't mean he ain't. Boy, he can't miss. 